So facing trouble with factorization in limits, we can do away with these two steps. How come? First trick, if x tends to 1, remember x minus 1 is one of the factors. So if x tends to 2, what is one of the factors? x minus 2. And if x tends to minus 2, which is one of the factors? Correct, x plus 2. Now going ahead with the next step over here directly, as I said, x tends to 1, so one of the factors is x minus 1. Now what you are supposed to do, listen carefully, first number divided by first number. So 3x squared divided by x, what will we get? 3x and last term or last number divided by last number. So what is plus 1 divided by minus 1? Minus 1. See the magic! x minus 1, 3x minus 1, we get directly. How come? I repeat it once again. First term 3x square divided by first term x that is 3x. Last term plus 1 divided by last term minus 1, we get minus 1. And denominator is same x minus 1, x minus 1 will get cancelled, 3x minus 1 3 into 1 minus 1 that is 3 minus 1 that is 2 okay so once again x tends to 1 so one of the factors is x minus 1 how will you get the second factor first term divided by first term that is 3x last term divided by last term that is minus 1 and then denominator also if you have a similar factorization you can do the same procedure i hope this trick will help you Congratulations Aman Patel for the correct answer. Click on the title and link above and if you are watching this on YouTube then click on the description link below to watch the detailed video lecture of the same. Bye.